They give Oscars for that. I do it like that. For stunts? No. Have you ever had a feeling your profession is significant and important, but it stays hidden to the point it lacks appreciation and recognition? If yes, you will definitely feel related to the film The Fall Guy 2024 and understand the director's idea. In the world of filmmaking, stunt performers have long been the unsung heroes behind some of the most thrilling and awe-inspiring sequences in cinema. Are they famous? No. Do they get world-recognized awards? No. How many movies depend on stunts? A great deal. Throughout the film The Fall Guy, David Leach, the director, emphasizes the physicality and precision required of stunt performers. From high-speed chases to death-defying leaps, the stunts in The Fall Guy are not only thrilling to watch but also serve as a reminder of the dedication and skill that goes into creating them. Nothing like a good twist. Who doesn't love a twist? This film is an amazing combination of funny, but witty dialogues, breakup and love story, even with some detective elements, which will make you laugh but keep on the edge of your seat. This is an epic story. Stop! We're gonna hide you. Nope, we're gonna beat this shit out of him. Colt Seavers, played by Ryan Gosling, is a stunt guy of a world-famous actor Tom Ryder. Colt is dating Jody, who is a camera operator there. An accident on the film set causes Colt's distance from Jody as he feels not being worth such a great woman anymore. He disappears from her life, still loving her, hoping she will find someone better. After 18 months Colt receives a phone call from a producer asking for his help in her new movie which director now is Jody. She lures him out saying Jody specifically asked asked for Colt to do the stunts. Upon his arrival Colt performs one of the film's most impressive achievements, its Guinness World Record-breaking cannon roll stunt. Leach, the director, began his career as a stuntman and stunt coordinator, working on high-profile films such as The Matrix and Fight Club. Having spent years in the field, he gained a deep appreciation for the hard work, skill, and risk that stunt professionals bring to the world of cinema. In an industry where the actors receive most of the glory, the contributions of stunt performers often go unrecognized. By directing The Fall Guy, Leach aimed to shine a spotlight on their vital role in bringing action sequences to life, which he emphasized by the stunt record. Oh, good, good, good. for him. I didn't approve him, you know that. Turns out Jody had no idea about Colt's participation, she never asked for him, and she's still angry with him for breaking up with her. Now Colt wants to know the truth why he was asked to come. The producer explains that the main actor, again Tom Ryder, is missing. She doesn't want it to go public, so she asks Colt, who knows Tom very well and who is not a public figure help her find him, save the movie and gain a chance to win Colt's love back. We need a big finale. Jody wants Colt to stay, but pretends it's only for the movie. Colt gets tangled into a dark scheme and ends up being accused of a murder which pulls him into a high-stakes adventure that tests both his physical and mental limits. This is insane, man. Uh -huh. Ryan Gosling's portrayal of Colt Seavers is one of the highlights of the film. Gosling brings a perfect balance of charisma, physicality, and humor to the role, making his character both relatable and entertaining. Blunt's performance is marked by her ability to switch between comedic and dramatic moments with ease. Her chemistry with Gosling is electric that reveal her character's insecurities and ambitions. Gosling's deadpan delivery, Blunt's quick wit, and the absurdity of the situations they find themselves in, contribute to the film's comedic charm. However, the humor never feels forced or out of place. Instead, it serves to enhance the action, providing moments of levity that make the film feel fresh and entertaining. The balance between action and comedy is further reinforced by the film's pacing. Leach knows when to ramp up the intensity with thrilling action sequences and when to slow things down with character-driven humor. This careful modulation ensures that the film never feels monotonous or overwhelming, keeping the audience engaged from start to finish. The film's action sequences are also a major selling point. The stunts are jaw-dropping, but they never feel gratuitous or excessive. Instead, they serve the story, heightening the tension and excitement in meaningful ways. I'm just a stunt guy! 
Leach's desire to honor stunt performers also comes at a time when there has been a growing conversation within the film industry about recognizing stunt work at major award ceremonies like the Oscars. Despite the dangerous and often physically demanding nature of their work, stunt performers have historically been excluded from such prestigious recognition. Within its entertaining, action-perfect blend the film brings lots of positive vibes with a gentle reminder that no profession should stay in the shadow and remain unrecognizable. You're a stuntman. No one's gonna notice whether you're here or not. No offense. I mean, sun taken.